Hello and welcome to a visual presentation of Backflow Happens. On our hydraulic board here we have Sue and Joe. They're going to help us with our demonstration today. Yesterday Sue was out walking in the yard and she got bit on the pit feet by uh, some fire ants. So she told Uncle Joe this morning, Uncle Joe I'm making you a seafood gumbo tonight, but you better take care of those fire ants. So Joe, who was planning on going fishing that afternoon with Bruce, his neighbor, ran out to his shop, got a hose and a bucket, and grabbed his fire ant poison, and poured it in his bucket, because he wants to take care of those fire ants. Opens his faucet, starts filling up his bucket, And all of a sudden he realizes his feet's burning too because uh, he's standing in a pile of fire ants. So uh, he's uh, brushing them off and getting his feet uh, taken care of because they hurt. Well, he realizes that uh, something's happening. He looks at his bucket and it's no longer filling up. There's been a break in the line. And when that happens, we're drawing back the contaminated poison into the water supply system. So he shuts off his faucet because he knows something's wrong. And he hollers over to Bruce. He said, Bruce, I don't have any water. We might as well go fishing. So he tells Aunt Sue he's going to take care of those fire ants when he gets back. So Aunt Sue, later that afternoon, she hears that the water's been turned back on. So she goes to make her gumbo. She uh, puts her pot under her sink, faucet, and starts filling it up. Now remember, some chemicals are odorless, colorless, and tasteless. So she doesn't realize that she's got ant poison as she's fixing to make her gumbo with ant poison. This is how easy we can contaminate our water supply. If Uncle Joe would have had the proper protection, on his outside hose bib, which is called a hose bib vacuum breaker. We install these on our faucets to break the effective siphonage should a backflow condition happen. We'll go ahead and turn our pump back on here. And as Uncle Joe was filling up his bucket, if that main would have broke, we'll shut our pump off to simulate that. This is how this little device protects our water supply system. Remember what Buster Backflow says, if you don't want to drink it, don't connect your water system to it. Backflow happens. 